Welcome to my store. Okay, we got some shrimp here at the store, and uh, they have this little thing on the side. We got one on a freshwater prawn, we got one on this, we got one on a few. So today we're actually going to try to find out what it is. Okay. Uh, see if it's something that's attached or if it's in or what. So we'll put them in a net. Should have got a clean net. Yeah, you should have. You want to? Yeah. Okay, give me a clean net. Okay. Yeah, there's stuff in this net too, son. Yeah, you put it in it. Okay. So, Aaron, you're blocking your light. You're blocking my light. I'm gonna try to pry this off. I don't know, is that under or above? It kinda looks like a pimple. Well, I can't tell if it's underneath his skin or if it's above it. Because you can't really get a knife in here. Hmm. Okay, let's go look at the other one. Uh, the one that's on the prawn. Well, let's get a container. Oh, I stood up too fast, woozy. Oof. I got I stood up too fast and I got woozy. My boy got dizzy? All the blood rushed out of his brain? Apparently. He got a big brain. A lot of blood in his brain. You see, logically, it's probably underneath the uh, cover. Okay. See, the pond is much bigger. So. Because otherwise, like, I think it's probably some kind of parasite. Won't he bite you? How is he going to bite me? He's got claws. Yeah, but I won't let him bite me. Okay, as you can see, it looks roughly the same. No, there's no break. So, the question is, ouch! I told you. Well, I didn't think I was going to let him. So it's right underneath. Isn't that like his gill? See, it's not fastened, but it's in there. Oh, it's underneath. Okay, we're getting it out. What is it? I don't know. It looks like some kind of a... Uh, a mass. Maybe it's a tumor. Okay, because there looks like a... some kind of a cyst, huh? But... As you can see now, that's all empty in there. Well, except for the top. Yeah. Doing shrimp surgery. Yeah. Okay. So, when we uh, get him to shed again, Maybe he should be... have... Well, because you see... When they shed their skin, the new skin is actually really soft and it goes over top of everything and then they recalcify it over the next 24 hours because they have calcium stored up in their body and then that calcifies it and makes it go hard. So let's see if uh, now that we got this out, if I'm going to try that one, I think I might try it with uh, like a much smaller, uh, like a little piece of wire or something. Because I don't think you have to be too sharp. Uh, like this is uh, a multi-tool, but uh, yeah. So 
We'll show you this uh, after he sheds. Uh, he doesn't shed very often because once they get this big, they don't uh, grow as fast. Yeah. But that was just some little experiment that I've been curious about for a while. and Like it looks like a growth. Like it's flat on the bottom. If anybody knows what it is, post a comment. Let us know. Because, I don't know. <laughs> Those could be eyeballs. That could be the spine. And, uh, so on. Okay then. Okay, so if you watch the other one, uh, well, it's not going to be the other one. I'm going to put them together. Oh, okay. If you watched the first half, we took the uh, tumor, whatever it was, off of the prawn. So now we're going to take it off the uh, little peppermint shrimp. Now that we know how. Well, now that we think we know how. We don't really know what we're doing. Uh, if you watch these videos, you'll catch that. We try a lot of different things. Now, what are you using? Well, this is a nylon tie that I put a bit of a hook on the end of it because my theory is that if I can just get in and hook this thing out here's what that looks like this one doesn't have any dots or anything on it, it kind of looks like a booger Well, it may be some kind of pus. Like a pimple. Yeah. Well, you see, this one will be a lot faster shed because this thing, uh, they shed really, really quickly. And so he's tiny. So. Well, what I'm going to do with him is I'm going to put him in a critter keeper, and that way we can keep him separate, and uh, we'll wait until he sheds, and then we'll do the third part of this video, and uh, at that point in time we'll know what happens. Okay? Shrimp surgery. 